The Data Logger app for Keithley's Kickstart software allows you to control multi-channel data acquisition units and collect readings quickly or over an extended period of time. Let's take a closer look at how to use this app. To get started, we'll need to select a connected instrument from the list on the left. Here we have a DAC 6510 using USB, but the Data Logger app supports any of the models shown. To open the app, simply double-click the instrument or drag the instrument to the center of the screen and select the Data Logger app. When the app opens, you'll see a list of available channels that can be configured to take measurements on the right and a block diagram of the configured scan on the left. Since we haven't configured any channels, this area is blank. To configure a scan, you can select channels one by one or select a group of channels at once by clicking the first channel, holding down the shift key, and then selecting the ending channel for the group. All of the selected channels are added to a block on the left side of the app. You can configure this block by selecting a measurement function for all of the channels in the group. When the measurement function is selected, the settings for the measurement appear in the center. The settings shown will differ depending on the measurement mode selected. You can rename the channels here or on the right by clicking the pencil icon. This can help keep your data organized between configurations. Double check the signal level before starting a long-term test with the Measure Now feature. Note that you can measure all of the channels in the group at once if needed. The settings here apply to all of the channels in the group and you can add or remove channels from the group at any point. Once you've configured the group, save the settings for the configuration which closes that block. Notice now that the configured channels are no longer selectable as they can only be configured for one measurement at a time. You can configure as many blocks as needed until there are no available channels. If you know what measurement mode you want and you want to quickly select channels for that measurement, select the function first which will display the available channels for that measurement. They can be selected and configured the same way as before. If you change your mind on any of the settings, just double click the block to open the configuration again and make the edits. Be sure to save the settings to keep the changes. At the bottom are the settings for the entire test. A data logging test is comprised of multiple scans, each scan taking measurements at each channel. You can configure how the scan is started and how the measurements on each channel are started. Configure a discrete number of scans to run or set a time limit for your test and the scans will be repeated until the timer expires. Selecting None allows the scan to run indefinitely. When your test is completely configured, the single app can be run at the bottom. For tests that use multiple data loggers or additional instruments like a source measure unit, use the Run All button at the top to start all of the apps at once. Kickstart can run up to eight instruments at the same time. During the test, view the incoming data using the Table tab or the Graph tab. Statistics on both the table and the graph are updated in real time, so you don't need to wait days to see how your long-term test is performing. All of the runs are stored in the run history so that data can be compared run to run. You can also export previous data to CSV or Excel format files. If you know that you ultimately want to export your data, you can opt to automatically export the data to the specified path during the run. Kickstart will automatically export the data and or screenshots of the graph every two minutes. To learn more about Kickstart and its many applications, visit tech.com backslash Keithley dash Kickstart. Thanks for watching.